Shocking news happens to royal family today as an update has been shared on the Princess of Wales' health after Prince William pulled out of a royal event due to a personal matter. A minute ago, Kensington Palace would not elaborate further but said the Princess of Wales is said to be doing well amid her recovery. Meanwhile, the Prince of Wales had been due to attend a memorial service today for the late King Constantine of Greece, who was also his godfather at Windsor Castle today, but decided not to attend. It is understood Prince William spoke privately to the Greek royal family in advance to apologize for his absence. However, according to a royal source, Williams' absence from the event today is understood not to be in relation to the Princess of Wales's continued recovery at home in Windsor from abdominal surgery last month. William, who is due to deliver a reading this morning at the service in St. George's Chapel, called the Greek royal family who were attending to let them know he was unable to go to the event. Constantine's eldest son, Crown Prince Pavlos, gave the reading in William's place. The heir to the throne has been adjusting his schedule and postponing some of his engagements following his wife's latest health battle. King Charles was also missing the service as he continues his cancer treatment. It now means Camilla is leading the royals at the service for the last king of Greece, who is a close friend of King Charles. The queen arrived separately to other members of the royal family as she was driven to the Galilee porch entrance. She was accompanied by Queen Anne Marie, former queen of the Hellenes. During the service, Camilla would be seen wiping away a tear as people gathered to celebrate the life of the late King Constantine, who died January 2023. Other royals, led by Prince Andrew, had walked to the chapel just minutes earlier. He was pictured arriving at the chapel alongside his ex-wife, Sarah Ferguson, with their daughters, Princess Beatrice and Princess Eugenie, also present. Royal watchers on social media have been outraged by Andrew being seen so publicly with the royal family after his spectacular fall from grace. The royal family has been shocked by the sudden death of Thomas Kingston, with Buckingham Palace paying a heartfelt tribute. A statement on behalf of his wife, Lady Gabriella Kingston, and his parents, Mr. Martin and Mrs. Jill Kingston, as well as his sisters, Mrs. Joanna Connolly and Mrs. Emma Murray said, It is with the deepest sorrow that we announce the death of Thomas Kingston, our beloved husband, son, and brother. Tom was an exceptional man who lit up the lives of all who knew him. His death has come to a great shock to the whole family, and we ask you to respect our privacy as we mourn his passing. Tom Kingston's wife, Lady Gabriella, is the daughter of Prince and Princess Michael of Kent, while Prince Michael is a first cousin of the late Queen Elizabeth. The 45-year-old financier was found dead at an actress in Gloucestershire on Sunday evening after emergency services were called to the scene shortly after 6 p.m. He was last pictured on Valentine's Day less than two weeks ago at a Shakespeare engagement with Queen Camilla. An inquest will be held to establish the cause of death, but there are no suspicious circumstances and no other parties involved. The King and Queen have sent their most heartfelt thoughts and prayers to Lady Gabriella Kingston and Mr. Kingston's family. A Buckingham Palace spokesperson said, The King and Queen have been informed of Thomas's death and join Prince and Princess Michael of Kent and all those who knew him in a grieving, much-loved member of the family. In particular, their majesties send their most heartfelt thoughts and prayers to Gabriella and to all the Kingston family.